Hey, what's up guys? Vajiri here. Hope you're having a good morning. Uh, I just woke up. It's like noon though, because I was up last night leveling pretty, uh, pretty late. But, uh, the reason why I was leveling pretty late, you know, that's a good sign, right? You're having fun, and I am having fun. Um, right now I think I'm 87, and I'm 65% of the way to 88, so I'm doing good. But I'm definitely not, like, really trying to just power through the leveling. Um, I know that there's like certain ways of like, you know, you can grind certain mobs or and people are doing AV early on to get really fast experience and stuff. Um, some people like to dungeon grind, but you know, since it's a new expansion, I don't mind questing around, seeing the new zones and seeing the new quests and stuff. It's a lot of fun. Um, my buddy Selena Gomez, if you guys watch the uh, watch the live stream, you'll know him. Uh, he actually ended up getting a server first, just overall plus, of course, server first warrior since he was the first guy at all to do it. And he did that by... Uh, by, uh, well, actually, I'm not even gonna say. I'm not even gonna say. But, uh, uh, <laughs> he got served first doing a, a, a more repetitive strategy. But that is a really effective way of getting to level 90 really, really fast. That's what you're after. Um, for me, taking a more relaxed approach. I mean, PvP doesn't start until next week anyway, so you might as well see the world. Um, maybe you can get some rep along the way, get some gold, get some quests done. Um, get, you know, involved in the story that, that uh, Blizzard has put together for this new expansion. And definitely see all these beautiful new places that they that they made. So, I figured I might as well, you know, be guided along the path that Blizzard is uh, laying out for you just so you can be, you know, immersed in their, in their, in their story that they're trying to tell. And I think that's pretty neat, so... That's what I'm doing right now, having a blast. Um, I haven't really been putting out as many videos on YouTube, just or at least not as many like high production value videos. I had a Fury video that I wanted to make, and I and I'm still planning on doing that, even though it'll be like level 90 in WoW. Um, I'm gonna be putting this level, this level 85 Fury video uh, eventually, but like right now I'm just really focused on leveling. And even though I'm not putting out as much stuff on YouTube, or as many high qual high production quality videos on YouTube. Um, I am streaming like a whole day. So I get up in the morning, like right now I'm, I'm making this little vlog to let you guys know what's going on. Just saying what's up. Uh, so I'll, I'll be streaming in the morning and then I go work out and then I come home and stream some more and stream until I go to bed just because, you know, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just leveling it up and I might as well uh, hang out with you guys on the live stream just because you guys keep me going and it's just always fun to hang out with you. So streaming a lot. Leveling pretty hard, well not pretty hardcore, leveling pretty easily, pretty relaxedly, but in a you know fun way, consistent way, definitely just going quest to quest, see what's going on, but um, if you guys want to come hang out with us, it is at twitch.tv slash bajir, after this vlog goes up, or after I finish the vlog even, I'll, uh, I'll start to stream up for the morning, we'll stream for a couple hours, I'll go to the gym, come back, do it again, um, but just as like an update to some of the things we are talking about in the last vlog with like Gung Ho and Game for Glory, you guys like blew gung ho away. They were so surprised and so like happy about how many of you guys actually went and first of all checked out their website. But second of all, like actually bought some gung ho. So that's awesome, you guys. I knew that uh, I knew that you guys would do an amazing job supporting me as you always do. And I know that if you guys did get gung ho, you're gonna love it. So thanks for doing that. Awesome job. I hope you guys continue to do that. I hope you like gung ho enough to you know and get some more for yourself. I know I do. I have it on auto buy because I love that stuff. But, uh, yeah, so I'll, I'll put the link in the description if you guys want to order more, if you didn't order, like, you know, if you tried some, you're like, man, this is good, and you wanted to get, get some more, the uh, little 50% off and free shipping deal still applies, so I'll put that link for you. Um, the Game for Glory thing is coming along very nicely as well, so if you guys want to come hang out with me and be able to game it up in some, like, pretty nifty little uh, game types, like King of the Hill, we can set up tournaments, we can just set up BGs together. Game for, game for Glory is something that you want to do. I'll put the link in the description there or for that thing as well. So I want to get that stuff out of the way because I don't want to oversaturate with you with all these uh, nice little business deals and like promotions and stuff because it's really exciting, awesome stuff, really good signs of progress, and of course really cool things I can give away to you guys. Um, and n At least with the Game for Glory, it offers me an interesting way of interacting with you guys, but um, you don't want to oversaturate though. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> But so far, Miss of Pandaria leveling is going awesome. Huge congrats to Selena. Uh, streaming a ton. I'm trying to think of the things that I wanted to talk about. Because I actually recorded this a second ago. And like the sound just cut off for no reason. So it recorded like the first second. So it was like, hey, what's up, guys? Bashir here. And I was like, fuck. But, um, oh, yeah, I guess they're changing certain things about warriors again. The warrior nerfs, they're not, they don't, well, these, oh, these mobs better not aggro me. I'm watching them. Mm hmm. Mm, okay. <laughs> the warrior nerfs didn't feel too bad. I mean, it's like, it's annoying to have your class nerf for no reason. And 
Unfortunately, at level 90, I'm pretty sure they're gonna be nerfing the Avatar Skull Banner Dragon Nora thing. I mean, like, not because it's like, it's just like a little too much, it feels like a little too much burst. But, um, one of the ways I suggest maybe changing things is instead of nerfing our consistent damage, um, or nerfing, you know, something stupid like Execute again, maybe they should make uh, Dragon Roar, not Dragon Roar, maybe they should make Avatar a 10% damage like increase with the freedom still there, the rage generation still there, but put it on a two minute cooldown rather than um, three minute cooldown with 20% plus damage increase. It's just like, you just don't need that much. Just put on, put on a two minute cooldown, don't make it give it much damage. Just make it like a freedom and like an extra rage generator. That's fine. But I mean, a little bit of damage is nice. That 10% damage, we'll feel that, that'll be fine. But yeah, I'm like, kind of worried. I don't know what Blizzard thinks they're gonna do, like if they're gonna just nerf our damage all the time, but hopefully everything is gonna stay approximately the way it is warriors feel pretty strong right now i mean at least in terms of my the world pvp ganking that's been going on i've been having some pretty interesting world pvp experiences uh <laughs> out leveling and stuff you know you see a couple horde see a couple alliance and they're just like looking at each other and targeting each other and you're never really sure what's going to go on and you know sometimes somebody we turn into quest and they go to right click the the npc and they accidentally right click a a horde and so they auto attack and the horde like turns around and attacks and all the friends attack and it just like turns into this big melee at a quest hub and it's just so much fun um <laughs> out there we had we had one of those things happen but um i was just riding along and this mage like he, he novas me gets out his water elemental and starts like shattering into me and i was actually able to kill him which is really funny and then he brought like three of his friends and they killed me and then <laughs> I saw them at a quest hub, and so I started like beating them up, and then all the alliance came in, and everybody was just having this huge fight. It was so much fun, and so world, world PvP is another reason why I like to quest, just because it keeps things interesting instead of just like grinding mobs or going and doing uh, dungeons over and over and over. Or just I assume some people are doing like AV, like I said, it's just like doing old content over and over. Um, uh, like world pvp is one of those things that keeps uh, questing fresh you know you see new places you see new storylines and you also see word so that's a lot of fun and i enjoy that part a lot so here pretty soon i'm probably gonna start the live stream um having a boss myth pandaria hope you guys are too um like i said i'm streaming like pretty much all day every day so if you guys want to just drop by and say hello if you guys want to have the stream on in the background while you're leveling that'd be awesome uh but right now i want to get back to it so thanks so much for watching guys please come hang out on the live stream it's twitch.tv slash hope to see you guys there and thanks for watching guys peace